30 years doing AC work, I never get line set leaks. Well this time, brand new line sets, I got line set leaks. Multiple pinholes, under the insulation. I tried to repair that, just to temporary, but it's got so many holes in it. You gotta change the whole line set. There's one there, one there, one there. Other pipe leaking. And so, it's, um, this is from January 2016, was the date code on the line sets. The brand here, I don't wanna talk bad about the brand, but they only have an 18 month warranty under line sets. I'm going in, I'm just gonna pull those out and go in with the Mueller 10 year warranty on the line set. Let's check copper thickness here. So this is the Mueller line set. This is the white insulation line set. I cut a two foot piece, pretty close to exactly two feet. 111 grams, 111.3 on Mueller. So they're the same. It's probably heavier with oil in it because this is unused. Okay, white line set. The quarter inch for two foot long, 66.8 grams. Mueller. Hmm. A little bit heavier on the quarter side. So the quarter seems to be a little thinner. So I have a pH tester. Let's check the difference on the Mueller, the white line sets, on the pH that's at the copper. So I had to add a little bit of water, make sure that the line set is wet. I did it on both of them. Let's see if we get on the indicator. Okay, you can see quite yellow, quite green. And then we match up our yellow. It's probably a pH of five. pH of five versus a neutral pH of seven. I tested another spot. This one's closer to seven. This one's closer to six. Here, here's a six. You can see it has quite a bit of green corrosion on it. This one, five, extremely acidic. Actually closer to a four on this one, extremely acidic. Let me show you here. I don't have to add any water because this one's already wet. I'll just cut it open. Okay, watch how quickly this strip changes to very acidic. See that? Extremely acidic all the way through the foam on that one. Now I noticed here if, if you open the pipe and you don't see it turning green it's gonna be neutral on its pH. I'm gonna show the pH of the line set tape here that I use. It's made by Berry Plastics and 
it's pretty neutral. Right about seven. Little spots there. You have to make sure not to touch it because if you touch it, your hands are highly acidic. And it puts the acid on there. So the line set tape's neutral. This section came right there. And you can see very acidic. Extremely yellow. So this one is five. I was comparing some different insulations here, checking the pH, and by cutting it open, doing a sample, didn't find any that were acidic. It's hit or miss. It's not all the pipe that's acidic. But I'll find sections which are extremely acidic. Here's the pH of my own line set. So you can see seven. Here's 150 feet of the white line set. I took off all the insulation. Now I wanted to show you can see there's more chemical corrosion wherever it's green. Green definitely goes crazy. Here was a leak I repaired, but you can see it was green. Right there. Notice on that where I repaired the leak, it's green on that end, but not green there. So that the acid is not even. It's here, it's black with some green, but on another, another line, you can see the difference in corrosion. So it's like hit or miss. It's like a, some sort of acid bath that didn't get rinsed or something going on chemically. This copper is less than two years old, but it looks like it's 50 years old because acid accelerates corrosion. But here's something interesting. A couple lines have no corrosion at all. And on the same system. And so, like even right here, zero corrosion, and we start getting corrosion. And it's like zero in the middle, and then corrosion. On When I was taking it apart, a part that had no corrosion is I slipped two pipes together in the same insulation. But less than two years, your line set should really look like this. It shouldn't be accelerating 25x on the corrosion, because that would be at 10 years, it would be like 250 year old copper, which is never gonna last. And so this is, I don't think this is a common issue because the distributor, I'm the first claim at the distributor on this stuff and so it's, it's i think it's just something with the quality control it gets missed i hope you like watching the video thanks for watching